There is a major problem coming to NBA 2K24. Look, guys, I thought about this. I know you thought about this, too. We've all thought about this. We've all thought what 2K is going to do in 2K24 with the new rookie coming in, Victor Webanyama. But I'm not just talking about how they're going to rate him and stuff like that. I'm talking about how Victor's influence is going to influence the park. It's going to be disgusting when everybody drops their how to make a Victor Webanyama build and everybody shows that you can make a stretch four who can dribble, break ankles, and shoot threes. It's going to be disgusting, I promise y'all. But you know what? Don't just take my word for it. Don't just take my word for it. We all know Victor is a monster when it comes to being able to dribble and move across the court, block shots, and even shoot. But on the my park, it might look a little bit different. It might look even more extreme because of the way people play 2k so i had to take it into my own hands i had to take a look at what nba 2k would be like if you are allowed to create a victor webanyama build and i'm not just talking about a 611 dude who can shoot because that's kevin durant i'm talking about a real life victor webanyama build a build that lets you build your player up to seven foot three, seven foot four, and still move like KD, shoot over defenders, and dribble like I don't know. We'll, we'll say KD. We'll say KD because it ain't Kyrie, but it's not, it's like KD. That would be disgusting, right? We're about to see, guys. If you're not subscribed, be sure to hit that sub button. More content every single day of the week. We're gonna hop into the game here after building our player just to see what this Victor Webinyama build will be like. We're gonna head out to the city to do this. Hey, shout out to the people behind this NBA 2K24 mod because we're gonna use this to get to the bottom of whether or not he's about to break the my part. Let's do it. Here comes the test. We're about to see what happens if you have seven foot three, seven foot four dribbling sharpshooters on the park. Y'all thought play sharps in and stretch bigs were bad. Well, what if you combine them out the gate? Shimmy fade. Oh, in his face, pump fake, green release. Oh, this is about to get disrespectful. I ain't ready for this. This is about to get crazy. Nah, but here on the defensive end, I want to be able to get blocks. Oh my goodness. I want to be able to get blocks, but if I can't get the block, I'm not going to worry about that because it's all about offense. Let me show you all what I mean. Oh, hold up. Snatch. Ankle breaker. Bro, that's too much space. Way too much space. I don't care how far from the three-point line I was. I really don't care. If you give me the space, I'll let it rain from deep. And now it's their turn. Three. Missing. My turn. I'm pushing. You know what? I might switch it up a little bit. Dribble move into the spin move into the lay, baby. Had to switch it up a little bit. Nothing too crazy, but just some light work in the paint. Now, here's the thing. Even if, even if they bring a double team on the park, it doesn't matter because I can shoot right over them. When I shoot the ball, it doesn't even say contested. That says open, and I turned and flexed on them before it went in. Disgusting. Nah, but I got my takeover still, and it really doesn't matter where I shoot from. I mean, I could just pull up and let it fly from deep every single time, but right now, I'm taking it to the rim, switching it up once again. Should have been an and one play. It was kind of all over me a little bit, but you know what? It's all good. Instead of taking it to the basket, though, I'm going to go back to doing what I do best. Shimmy, fade, pump fake, lay. I'm going to keep using the footwork and hitting jump shots, mid-range and three-point shots, because that's what I do best with this build. And nobody can guard it. I mean, look at this. Look, look at look what I mean. Nobody can guard this. I'm just shooting over everybody. Nah, man. Everyone's gonna try to make a Victor Webanyama build. That's gonna be the main build, the go-to attempt in 2K24. And if you could do anything even close to this, bro, it's game over. I promise all this game over. None of us are going to survive 2K24 if this is possible. This would be the biggest mistake you could make in NBA 2K. You better not. This. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I Look, I shot it, and I was hoping it would miss. That's how dangerous he is. I shot it, and I was hoping I would miss. But, nah. It would be a major mistake if 2K let us make anybody even close to Victor Webanyama for the sake of their game, for the sake of our sanity. Do not let us do this to them. Like, please. I don't want it in the game. I know you don't want it in the game. There's no way you do. Because if y'all see what I'm doing right now, this is just with a normal three-point rating and takeover. But because I'm so tall, it says open every time. Man, I can't get over how disrespectful I've been. But, hey. It's 7 to 18, and now they're trying to bring it in the paint. Oh, my goodness. I forgot I could play defense. I forgot I could block shots. 
I'm really out here cooking up, man. It's 7, no, 9 to 18 now, and look, I really don't need that much space. I really don't need any space. Look, you're going to be right in my face, and I'm still just going to pull up in yours. Like, that's a green. A green. I'm not, guys, please understand, I'm not hitting, like, full whites or anything like that. These are greens. These are green release shots with takeover, and they say they're wide open. This game is over, bro. If this happens, the game is done. This is it right here. Final possession. Get the ball. Get it to our main man. The point guard. The, the Victor Webinyama replica build. If he was a 99, spin move to the leg. That's it. We're done. Hey, that's it for me, guys. We are done. It was a fun one, but not a long one. So it's kind of obvious that if they allowed us to make a stretch big that can also dribble and be like what? Seven foot three, seven foot four? Yeah, the game's done. The game's cooked. We're all done. It's over. Victor Webanyama is going to do some damage in the league. I mean, he's got Greg Popovich as his coach. And I think that with him in the league, everyone's going to want to build a player like him for the city, for the My Park, just like they did when Curry was dominating, just like they did when LeBron was dominating. Whoever that cover athlete is, whoever that star player is, whoever's got the most unique build, we're all going to want to be them. But hey, I guess we're about to find out. Thank you guys so much for watching. Once again, if you're not subscribed, be sure to hit that sub button. More content on the way, and I'm done. Peace.